but tasted nasty. Work in it, my honey. Ooh. Ooh. Um. <clears throat> anyway, um, one of the things I like to do is go yard selling or go to Salvation Army. Um, Salvation Army here don't really have that much stuff, so sometimes yard sales are the best because. I can go to a yard sale and get a ton of stuff for eight bucks. Anyway, occasionally when I buy books or other items, you get those little specials. Now, what a special is is something that the person accidentally left. You know, like you buy a pair of jeans and you find a dollar bill. You know, something like that. Um. Sometimes I buy books or uh, photo albums, and when I do, I actually end up finding stuff. Somebody had a stack of, um, I don't remember exactly where this was, but this was right here in the town I live in. Somebody had a stack of like postcards, greeting cards, stuff like that. And inside, there was two things that got me. Uh, one, this was absolutely lovely. I loved it. This is a um, postcard for Kentucky. And Aub Aubrey. I keep saying Audrey. Uh, this is apparently the same sort of card that I got wiped out. Pretty horse. Um, this one, what shot me. In between these was two pictures. This... I have no idea when this was made. But this is a slightly up-to-date photo of somebody, a little girl. And, but this must have been taken in the mid-90s. This was in there. There's a sticker on the back that kind of gives her a little mustache ring. Uh, this was done at a photography place here. So if somebody has this photo, and from the looks of it, I would say the little girl in this pic is related to this. Another thing I, I came across one day at a Salvation Army was this, uh, photo album and I picked this up because I like you know to use photo albums for uh, you know sorting small cars and stuff like that and at first I don't know why it didn't dawn on me but at first I thought this was like that default picture that would always be in a photo album or in a picture frame but it wasn't until I got this home that I opened it up and I realized all but two pages all but two sections were filled with photos. And I have no idea who these people are. Creepy. Girl in this photo kind of looks like the girl in this one. And, you know, it's, um, from the looks of it, it's 80s? I think they're all taken at a different time. These are various photos of people. Here's a family photo for one. Um, photo of someone's grandmother out in the trees. That empty page. Flowers, flowers, uh, flowers, can't open these pages no more, why, flowers, someone's grandma, with a sticky dot on the bottom, um, Old people's birthday party. A young girl. 
Yeah. Older people's birthday party. And, you know, I have no idea who these people are. But I, and I can't figure out where any of these places are. Because these are just random people's homes. And none of these parts of these homes even stick out. So I have no idea who these people are, where they come from. But uh, anyway, I'm going to actually search online to see if, you know, somebody actually has these photos. If these people exist. If not, I got a weird collection of photos. <laughs> but, um, you know, that's some stuff that you find. You find all sorts of stuff in between junk that people don't go through. So anyway... Uh, what have you found in anyone's stuff uh, at secondhand stores or yard sales? Let me know.